Hey everybody, it's Ray with the Hey Ray team. And occasionally when we have home inspections done on uh, houses that we sell, once in a while little things crop up that uh, cause some buyers some concern and usually the seller will address those um, as part of a, an amendment to an agreement. And that's actually what we're doing here today. So we're at a house that uh, once they did the home inspection, they found there was some mold in the attic. Uh, that was caused by some insulation that had been blown in by the seller you know, years ago, and they had covered up the uh, the the, um, the soffit vents on the house. So over time, moisture got into the attic and caused uh, a lot of mold. So what we've done here is we've brought in a company to come and remediate the mold. They're basically putting in channel vents uh, to go up from the soffits so that any insulation doesn't uh, inhibit the airflow. And they're going to spray the underside of the uh, of the house of the the roof as well to ensure that the mold is encapsulated and then they'll come back in another week and uh, test it so that's some just just another one of the things that uh, the hay ray team does you know we, we've arranged with the seller seller's actually uh, out of the country right now so we've done all the arrangements let the contractor in arranged for the quotes etc and uh, i'm going to turn things over to peter and let him talk a little bit about exactly what uh, what their company does and what they're uh, what they're doing here today thanks a lot everybody have a great day well first up what we like to do, or what you have to do, we got to get some air flowing in the in that attic. The soffits were unfortunately clogged, as Ray had mentioned. So we dig down, open up the soffits, and throw a more vent to allow continuous airflow from the soffit up through the rest of the attic. If your attic doesn't breathe, it'll trap moisture from the inside of your home. That trap moisture is what causes the mold on the underside of the sheeting. We allow for airflow. It allows for a dry attic and prevents that mold from growing. For the existing mold on the undersides of the sheeting, we're applying with an airless spraying machine a product called Foster's 4050 Mold Barrier Defense. This completely will encapsulate any existing mold that, re that is in the attic. Once we have completely encapsulated all mold within the attic, we do an air sample. When that air sample is collected, we do one in the attic, we'll take one in the main floor of the home, and the one outside. We want people to know that the air in their home is safe, and the air in the attic is the same as the air outside when we're done. Very good. Thank you, Peter. No problem, Ray. 